Hello, welcome to another news video. Uh, there is much to give thanks for, isn't there, as we come into this autumn season and we look around and despite the difficulties, uh, we've seen God at work and we see God at work day by day in our lives and in the life of our church. Thinking about our church life, uh, we've seen the children start coming back not only to school but to wildlife in our church uh, activities. We've also uh, looking ahead to Alpha that's going to be begin uh, in a week or two's time uh, and we're welcoming in new people and looking forward to being able to exercise hospitality. Remember Hospitality October uh, that's coming up, an opportunity to invite people into our homes. There's so much to give thanks to God for and it's appropriate because as a church we're on a journey, a Barnabas journey, uh, looking through the Acts of the Apostles and discovering something of the person of Barnabas who was known for his extraordinarily um, thankful and generous character. Well, it's totally appropriate then as we come to look at this coming Sunday, that Sunday should be marked out as a Thanksgiving Sunday. Uh, normally we do a special offering around November time. Um, under the, the banner Thanksgiving. Well, this year we've brought it forward because there are some big, big challenges uh, for us as a church, uh, particularly financial. You may remember that uh, we uh, had uh, extensive flooding during the summer. Well, we need to uh, now uh, begin to take uh, hold of that and see it not just as, a, as a, a negative thing, but as an opportunity for us to restore and renew some of the fabric of our church in order to be able to do our mission of welcoming people in and bringing them to faith and helping them to grow as disciples and step out into God's mission. So we're launching this Sunday a particular offering and a call to members of our church to give with real generosity, much like Barnabas did uh, all those years ago. And uh, we have a particular target for this Thanksgiving Sunday of £70,000. We're praying that God will provide us with what we need in order to completely redo the heating of our church and the kitchen that is downstairs and has served us so well for Alpha courses and for different events and night shelter as we serve the homeless. Currently, the heating does not work and the kitchen has had to be completely stripped because of the flooding. So we have a, a fairly significant challenge, hence Thanksgiving uh, this coming Sunday. Uh, so let's, as a church, be thankful to God for his great provision. Let's ask him, and can I encourage you to pray and ask how you might contribute towards this particularly important offering as we meet what seem to be really important and urgent needs in the life of our church. And let's do it with such thankful hearts, trusting God, because he is the God who provides. We know that. And as we give to him, so he takes our gifts and he makes them into something beautiful and he multiplies them for his kingdom. So there is much to be thankful for. And as we look to Sunday and gathering together for our different services, let's pray that God will continue to pour out his spirit, making us people of faith, full of the Holy Spirit, just like Barnabas was those many, many years ago. So we continue on the Barnabas adventure, the Barnabas way this Sunday. And I look forward to seeing many of you then and be blessed in the meantime. Have a great weekend and may God pour out his generous spirit upon each one of us.